Today is a very unimportant but kind of important holiday in the United States. It is Thanksgiving, uh, a holiday where we basically just gorge ourselves on food uh, and remember the, the native people helping the, the colonists that came to the U.S. for the first time back in, uh, I don't know, like the 1600s or something like that. I don't actually know when, when Thanksgiving occurred. But today, uh, we are going to recreate Thanksgiving in the best of ways here in, in tarot cards um, by making an, <laughs> making an Easter bunny, <laughs> okay? Um, I think that this is the, the only holiday-related thing that I could possibly come up with. Uh, to do in in tarot cards, so we're gonna we're gonna try to get an Easter Bunny, and that's that's basically gonna be my win condition uh, for this episode. Now the Easter Bunny is kind of crazy. He makes all adjacent crops produce chocolate bars, um, which is crazy. Chocolate bars go for like a lot. They they sell for 252, so like really really good. Um, all rabbits now produce Easter eggs, and then if he's ever adjacent to a withered crop, he turns into the true Easter Bunny, <laughs> which I got a lot of questions about as well. Um, turns all rabbits into corrupted bunnies that then kill the other animals on the island. The whole thing is, it's a mess. Um, but that's, that's an issue for another time, if I'm perfectly honest with you. Let's, let's just get the, the ball rolling immediately. I kind of don't really think that cows are are that valuable for what we're doing in this episode but i'm i'm gonna do them anyway right because i mean logically speaking it it do be valuable uh to have have your cows on the island i might die right here <laughs> there's there's a small chance let's take carrots we know we're gonna need them we're not dying which is good um how do i want to make these carrots work i want to make sure that the carrots what exactly what, what do we even do with carrots right they, they get eaten by by rabbits rabbits produce rabbit feet right so the rabbit feet let's take a look at the bunny again here plus two production uh and plus one water to every carrot on adjacent islands okay that's good. Um, that's that's really good. You produce the rabbit foot. That's fine. Here's what I would like to do. I think that it would be most valuable for me to... Yeah, this is fine. I think it would be most valuable for me to, to maybe set up the, these carrots here on this island, right? Uh, we can put the wheat right there. This will just keep flowing. Th these carrots provide me with, with a good... Okay, I should be very, very cautious here or else I'm going to just lose. <laughs> that's good. Um, that's very good. I do think you maybe want some chickens eventually, but I am going to take more carrots. Our, our win condition kind of relies on, on bunnies and, and carrots because I'm creating my Thanksgiving uh, feast, which is only carrots, I suppose. Um... Don't ask a lot of questions, I won't give you a lot of answers, and then we can all live harmoniously together, is the way that I see it. Give me another one of these, you know you're gonna need it. This is now going to put me into a bit of a mess, if I'm, I'm perfectly honest. Because I need to... I gotta get some land? Because I then need to plant carrots over here as well. It's a heavy investment, in, in all seriousness. Um, but it's an investment that needs to get done. I am going to take these rabbits. Okay. But ideally, I would really like to get a, a large fence <laughs> before we do the rabbits. Although, you know what? Maybe we don't need to do that. Yeah, you know what? I actually think I'm fine with this. I'm gonna take these rabbits. Um, a hundred is due in one day. Gonna be gonna be a little tight, but I I think we're gonna be okay. Hundred gold debt comes in, Ugh, little expensive. Okay, little expensive, but not too bad. We're gonna put down something here. The carrots. Let, let's take a look at carrots real quick. They are used to make shredded carrot. Right? There's also been an update to the game. The mixer and the oven are now uh, able to be found, <laughs> which is hilarious to me. Um, I definitely think that they both were not working, but that's beside the point. Um, they can now be found, so that's good. We, we can theoretically make carrot yogurt, but I, I think there's a greater chance that I make this, this messed up chocolate cake. 
um, instead. But the important thing is that the greater is going to have to go on this island with the bunnies. So I, I think we can make that happen here uh, as long as I... We're going to be a little tight on the old money. I do think the greater is actually very important to take right now to ensure that we have it. We're not producing any energy right now, which is a problem. I mean, realistically, you, you really would prefer... You really would prefer a fence? I guess we have a fence. Uh, apple trees are just production to cows. I'm not worried about that. I'm going to go pretty heavy on the reroll. Okay, um... That's actually tough, man. That's actually really tough. We can do carrot juice instead. So that's that's three versus two. So the juicer is actually better. Um, what can we use carrot juice for? I'm not sure there's anything we can use carrot juice for. So that kind of just then dies right there. Um, yeah, it's just it's just just never ending never-ending carrot juice um it's a tough decision really uh but i i think i'm going to take the medium fence here and and my plan is to put it right here and then my plan is to to fill this entire thing with as many rabbits as you can possibly see now fuel wheat does sound important for us to get fuel uh but i think that we also need to worry about getting some water and i think a watery tree is a fantastic idea really that that saves us like a, a whole heck of a lot of water i think i need to turn on nerd mode for a little bit it's so ugly but man is it useful <laughs> so you go right there i think you can do it again and just that way you you have your water and uh okay more rabbits that's that's lovely so rabbit do not want to put the cow in there. Do not do that. Rabbit, rabbit, rabbit. It's just increasing the cost of those by so much. But it's buffing them like crazy. Plus one production to rabbit per carrot on the farm. Uh, every rabbit is giving me 28 rabbit's feet. <laughs> okay, that's really good. There's going to be an alarming amount of resources that we get out of that. Um, the water chickens... They require corn, so we can't can't really make that work. Plus one production of crops gives a little bit of water. I do love the idea of more carrots. Do not get it twisted, okay? Watery trees are obviously a, a huge plus. But I also am kind of like... I'm not even sure that we can make that work. <laughs> the water wells are, are not going to do enough water for me. I do think it's important, though. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I'm going to reroll here. Three water wells is better than, than two, okay? So I'm going to actually go kind of crazy here and, and lay those down right there. And, I mean, it's more water wells. It's, it's a huge production cost, but I just want you... I want you to realize that I'm already getting, like, 2300 a turn right now. <laughs> so it's clearly, like, kind of fine. I'm just going to buy a bunch of land, man. I know I'm going to need it. So so do all of that. Let's, let's start. You know you're going to put more carrots up here in the future. And your turn. You know you're going to put more, more carrots up there. So just, just keep, keep the, the ball rolling. Watery cows, zero water cost to adjacent island crops. Okay, you're really good. <laughs> you're really good. You have to go here. I mean, I guess I could put you in there if I really wanted to. Um, yeah, now our water is crazy. I'll, I'll put you in there. Look, we're, we're, we're making some stuff happen. Dude, I got so much money already. That's great news. That's great news. I need some more fences. The watery trees are no longer useful. Fuel infuser, don't really care. The grater is important, but we don't have a way to, to actually do anything with it yet. And we're actually going to need two graters, which is really annoying, um, in order to, to maximize the, the production there. 
So put it here for now. This is technically more valuable. Well, actually, no, it's not. <laughs> this is definitely not, but that's fine. Um, Reroll me another grader. Okay, now you got to get some, some energy because we're losing 20 energy a turn. But we're so far ahead, man. I mean, we're, we're like light years ahead. I'm not really concerned. Electric carrots is perfect. Rabbit produces five energy per production. Beautiful. Those are then going to go right here. Uh, I'm now producing... Uh, what the frick? <laughs> I'm producing 685 energy. That seems decent, actually. Uh, how did I completely obliterate the game again? This quickly? That says two and five. I thought that said two factorial, brother. And I was like, what the frick? <laughs> we're, we're doing we're doing some janked up math now. Uh, but it was a, a five leaking in. Just don't worry too much about it. Give me more carrots. I'm, I'm all in on the carrot life, man. Don't care about the animals. All cows turn into plant cows. Don't really care. Corn costs no water, uses energy. None of these are good. Um, but this one does not hurt me. So I'm, I'm just going to take it. And then we're going to keep this nonsense flowing up here with even more carrots and that's just going to i mean every carrot we place is is cranking our production to an oblivion now do you need a cutter cutter can cut the carrot but so can the uh so can the other things so we don't really care about you don't really care about apple trees medium fences can be good in the future don't care about them right now plus one production for every carrot produced in a three island range pretty good <laughs> that's pretty good i'm gonna put this giant carrot right here i want to take a look at his production right now uh yeah it's 199 i'd argue that's decent <laughs> i think that's a, a pretty good number for sure now your water cost is crazy um so we can prepare to put a cow right here in the future don't care about the the big cow though really don't care about the solar panels either this is largely irrelevant um wheat cost goes to zero i don't care about we, we gotta start maybe thinking about like fuel corn in this one um you can get like a lot going with that and i think that'd be a good thing to just like drop all the way over here just because fuel corn like it it, it gets a little I don't know. It, it it takes up some space. And and I think that we can create a little production area over here. And I still see this area over here turning into some kind of factory as we build up. Um, so give me some melters. We may not use them right now. But I'm I'm really I'm starting to take a look at the idea of eventually we're gonna get chocolate bars, right? Like our crops will produce chocolate bars because I'm gonna buy an Easter bunny. So I'm going to need all of this stuff. We're producing the carrots. I need refined sugar, which require, I've never seen a refinery in my life, um, but that's gonna require us getting raw sugar, which requires, all of this comes back to sugar cane. So we're gonna need sugar cane. We're also going to need chickens because we're gonna need eggs. <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna take more rabbits. I'm not, a, I'm not a little freak, okay? I'm not a little freak. So give me give me more rabbits. There goes my uh, there goes my damn water immediately. Cause all of these carrots are now they're yeah they're six water minimum a piece. It might be more. <laughs> so I think in a perfect world you got to get another fence uh, up on the top. So let's we're going for actually small fence here, if possible. The cocoa trees also would have been very good to get here. I'm going to re-roll around a little bit in order to try to get... Hey, dude, it's the freaking mixer. God, it would have been nice to see you like a thousand times on the last run. Um, I don't need you right now. I mean, frick, I can't not take the giant carrot, though. The, the giant carrot is going to give me what I need in the future. The juicer is very important, too. I need a small fence. I need the sugar cane, too. <laughs> I uh, look, we're it's going it's going kind of crazy. It's going crazy. Sugarcane goes here. Yeah. And then a melter is going to go there. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is fine. So sugarcane just just to confirm, this is this requires a lot of planning. Sugarcane goes into a juicer. So 
So I gotta get a damn juicer at some point. Right now, I'm not even sure it's producing anything, right? No, oh, maybe it is. I mean, I'm, I'm losing muchos water right now. The electric carrots are good, but just don't, don't worry about them right now, okay? Just don't think about it. I don't want these medium fences, man. This is not... I really need, I really need a small fence. But I don't think you're ever gonna give me a small fence. The watery trees can at least curb this a little bit. Two times to all slots. It'll be really, really valuable. Okay, it'll be really valuable. So fill, fill this up. Watery tree goes here and here. That helps a tiny bit, but it does not help enough, okay? It's still gonna require a little bit of work. Yeah, it's gonna require a little bit of work. You can actually throw a water cow into here now. That's huge. Cause this, there's, there's all kinds. This just ramps the production of everything. <laughs> this is so many carrots, man. There's so many carrots. I wonder if this can be our, our workshop island. No, it can't be because I think, I think you're okay putting more sugarcane into here. Well, it is kind of going to be your work. Well, okay, it's not going to be. Uh, except the Easter Bunny turns everything into chocolate, so then I'm not even going to have sugar anymore. I don't know. We'll figure it out when the time comes. I'm not too worried right now. Um, I keep on wanting to take the mixer because I'm like, it's never showing up, man. It's never showing up, but it, it'll show up. I'm not worried. So there's the juicer. That's now making this. Then it goes into a melter. Okay. That makes this. Then it goes into a centrifuge. Okay, so your next major step is centrifuge. And I'm I will I will re-roll to get it, to be honest with you. I, I'm a I'm a simple guy. Don't care about the mixer. Centrifuge may not be available yet. Give me two more watery trees, okay? Um that's gonna take care of you guys. That's gonna take care of you guys. 108 water a turn. We we love that. There's my centrifuge. I don't believe the centrifuge fits on this island at this point. So you now have to go here. Okay, that's gonna centrifuge the those into raw sugar. Then we need a refinery. Okay, this should all flow now. Is that an accurate assessment? Those all go into there. Beautiful. Raw sugar. I mean, dude, we're making 11,000 a turn. <laughs> it's, it's, it's busted. It's busted. It's very good. Um, don't need any of you. Don't need any of you. Another centrifuge does not really help me. More rabbits is pretty much always going to be good, though. Because all... I mean, these are alone producing almost 800 uh, carrots a turn. <laughs> Which is absurd. There's my refinery. Okay. Um, sure. You go on to there. I now need more fuel. Which is okay. I can make that happen. The antenna energy is not going to be a problem. What I, what I really need is, um, a fuel cow. Produces fuel equivalent to the total of fuel produced in adjacent islands. Could be actually really good uh, with this fuel corn. I, I think I'm actually gonna take you. Um, I need to get a, a hole for you, but plus 10 production to animals now consume fuel instead of water. No, 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 no. We'll, we'll make eggs have a chance to, to produce uh, thingies. Get, okay, female rabbit gives a card of the cheapest rabbit. I, I'm not worried about you. I got enough rabbits right now. Give me a medium fence right here put a fuel cow in there you're now producing 100 fuel a turn this should now be fully functional we'll be centrifuging i i need more sugarcane but that's going to centrifuge into refined sugar or whatever refine into refined sugar then the next step after that is a mixer where we also need milk what the hell is this that's how you make chocolate I don't really actually need chocolate. <laughs> That's kind of actually the end of that. Because the chocolate's gonna get produced eventually. Kind of, I think. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> 
eventually we'll make this damn cake, man. I need to make sure we get the flower getting up. Um, which means that we, we actually genuinely need another area of just wheat. But that'll, that'll be fine. Um, the more sugarcane is, is really useful too. I mean, you could theoretically put wheat on this island. But I think you can you can feed the wheat from somewhere else. Give me the sugar cane for right now. I want to take a look at this Easter Bunny again. All adjacent islands crops produce chocolate bar, but not all crops. That's an important distinction. Um, because that now means that I can afford to... We, we can... Uh, we, we don't have to kill our production here, right? We can make the chocolate bars come in from somewhere else. Now, fuel wheat can be milled, and it still produces fuel. It's a beautiful day for me. So that is going to go here, which is then going to use the water cow in order to not uh, use up the production. We love that. I would really love to double our, uh, double our structures again, but I think that that's probably wishful thinking. The fuel wheat comes in here, producing just a ton of fuel, which we love. And then we're going to get eventually a mill set up on this island. I mean, you might as well just buy the island. I'm not even worried. We're, we're really not worried about the... Uh, I don't need a refinery. We're not worried about our money. <laughs> this, this game is uh, it's a little it's a little too easy for Tyler now. <laughs> it's more a sandbox game than it is a challenge. But that's that's just the way I like it, to be honest with you. Put me in the damn sandbox. Let me let me play in the sand. We can we can mess with this still. Grader is not important. Cutter is not important. I mean the giant carrot. Don't get it twisted. Still pretty good. I mean, it's still still really solid. The sugar cane as well. Um, I do think you can actually afford to continue to put it there. I know that I have fuel cows somewhere here <laughs> and they refuse to to happen if fed milk produces a cow egg you give seven eggs i do need you because i need eggs so so that's fine put my fuel cows in here we're not producing 360 fuel per turn i didn't place my giant carrot here you go oh my god i put it in the worst spot <laughs> that's an absolutely miserable spot okay it's fine it's fine you are going to put in the eggs are going to go onto this island. Can I produce everything needed for this cake on that island? T take a look at your cake real quick. T take a look at the cake. We need an oven. I don't know how big an oven is, okay? So for safety measures, we're going to put the chickens here. What the hell do you eat? You eat corn, don't you? <laughs> I don't have corn on this damn island. Yeah, you eat corn. You son of a freaking. Okay, that's fine. We'll, we'll get some corn. I don't think that fuel corn you can eat, though. I need to just get regular corn. Um, But that's fine. Did I need the fermenter? Fermenter is needed to make dough. But I don't think dough is actually needed to make the cake, man. Yeah. We need butter still which requires centrifuging scalded milk. <laughs> okay, that's fine. We'll figure that out in the future. Silo I don't care about. Who's Banicula? Transforms the crops into the withered versions. I don't care about you. I want the Easter Bunny, though. I need uh, corn. Very good. Okay, um, that's going to go now. We can put you right here. I'm not too worried about these chickens. Maybe they'll die, I don't know. But just, just put them over there for now. You are consuming a bunch of water again. Why are you consuming so much water? I mean, each one of those is consuming 15 water, so that's... That's a small dilemma, I suppose. 20 production to cows. Corn costs no water, but uses energy. Two times production, five gold to all corn. Honestly... We'll, we'll take those. <laughs> we'll take those. That's not a that's not a bad trade deal. Corn corn production goes through the roof. We love it. Bird's nest we don't care about. Carrots I don't care about. 
none of this I really care about right now. Um, we do need to get some more water. Fermenter we don't care about either. Giant carrot, unfortunately, I don't care about now either. I screwed that up. Something fierce. The centrifuge will be important, I think. Um, in order to... We need to get the scalded milk. We need a fridge, still. I need to set up another cow pen on the top, I think. How, we, how are we doing on fuel? We're completely fine. The water cows could still be useful. Um, that could help us with... Honestly, these fuel corn down here. We can uh, set up with a cow that gives us our water back that's very good then we need to make sure that we set up cows up here to feed into the centrifuge this is going to be the oven so i think this has to be cows so now we're looking for a giant cow is fine that's completely fine corn feeds in i'm telling you dude the factory is gonna work it's gonna work giant cow they they eat a lot of water but that's okay we need to get a melter onto this island for the the scalded milk back to negative water <laughs> there's our melter um centrifuge i don't care about i'm looking for some some watery action here some water action is gonna be good I don't know what necessarily water action I, I'm going for currently. Water cows? They just make the crops not cost anything. But we don't really have that issue. <laughs> it's not the crops that we got a problem with. I mean, maybe these are problematic. Okay, I mean, I, got, I guess we can save a little bit with that. But now I need another damn fence. You gotta put a melter here for the scalded milk. So, cows are currently not producing because of that. That makes sense. Yeah, I need I need to get myself another, uh, another pen. There's my Easter bunny, though. <laughs> so, take your Easter bunny. There's my wind condition, which is fun. Makes all adjacent islands crops produce chocolate bars. We're going to build our own area for that here soon. Give me a medium fence. You're going here. A water cow goes into here. That did not help at all, which sucks. Okay. Yeah, it actually just like literally doesn't matter. Water chicken. <laughs> Honestly, it's not a terrible idea. Two, two water chickens gets us back on track. So, put one here. Yeah, well, that's already back on track. So, the Easter Bunny makes adjacent crops produce chocolate. That means I need the Easter Bunny to go here. Although, that's going to make those produce chocolate. I need the Easter Bunny to go here. Crops here. So, Easter Bunny... Now, all of my rabbits produce Easter eggs, which is fine. That does not bother me. Things are still a little messy, though. The lake makes animals cost nothing, which is a really important one. Turns all water surplus into wine. <laughs> Plus two value to every item a crop produces, but double the water. It actually doesn't really hurt us much, which is wild. Okay. <laughs> This is expensive, okay? Um, we're obviously making some pretty expensive plays. But... Water cost decreasing rapidly. Which is lovely. Water chicken <laughs> slides into... You can just slide into here. Water cost is, is only a little right now. It's only a little. Currently, you guys are, are also an issue, so give me fast 292 water back. I did not see those. That's my bad, honestly. 
I, I respect that. This is a water issue too, but I'm not worried about that yet. What do I need? I need something like peanuts, to be honest with you. Because now you go... I mean, another Easter bunny is actually irrelevant in a lot of ways. Um, but now you can basically fill out on this island peanuts. And this is going to produce chocolate. Which is, like, really good. Yeah, that's all chocolate. That's going to be very, very solid for me. I don't need more Easter bunnies. Um... What I need... What is it that I need? <laughs> Am I good on fuel? 325, I'm completely fine. Another mixer is going to... Well, I don't need chocolate, so I don't need that. The Fantastic Chocolate Factory. Three times gold cost to all chocolate bars. I mean, that seems pretty good. <laughs> that seems that seems really solid to me. Um... Especially because we, we could theoretically... I'm basically making peanut butter chocolate, man. Delicious. Really delicious. Um, three times production. All trees planted or to be placed turn into cocoa trees. You can go here. That's going to make the production of all... What the frick? Do those stack? <laughs> I mean, you're going to try, right? 32,000? We, we technically cannot really afford... It's it, We're surprisingly tighter on cash than what I want to be right now. Um, do we have a water cow still? Because I could see that being a, a relatively valuable investment for me. 34,000. So the, the chocolate factory, we're actually about to run out of fuel if I place down another one of those two. It's a little scary. Just just chill for right now. I don't know, we might lose the peanut gnome. Everything in range island, don't care. Don't care. What, what do I need? Fuel peanuts? Three fuel for every production? I mean, I'm back to needing water again, unfortunately. Fuel cows will, will save that production so that I can lay down another chocolate factory in the hopes that it's going to three times my stuff. And this can afford to go here. We actually don't have anything that needs to go here because your oven is eventually going to go there. The hope here is maybe the fridge can fit on that island um i have to imagine it can then again i've never seen a fridge so i'm under the impression it don't exist because <laughs> i i haven't seen it do we need the pasteurizer this that's used to make that but the fridge is look at look at butter Butter is two of these in the fridge. That's melter into centrifuge. I should be making that. Right? I should be making that. It's still tight, man. I mean, it's it's alarmingly tight. Plus one water and plus one crop. Okay. Just re-roll. <laughs> Just re-roll. All adjacent islands crops produce chocolate bars. Okay. We're, we're gonna go for, for broke here. This is now like over a thousand chocolate bars. <laughs> I, th I think that that's probably going to be pretty solid. Okay. I think that's gonna be pretty good. Right? Because this is now going to be... Yeah, it's it's a million chocolate. <laughs> it's 581,000 uh, every turn off of chocolate bars. Yeah. Logically speaking, probably a pretty good play. Um, we can breathe for a little bit. There is my fridge. Okay. It's happening. It's happening, ladies and gentlemen. We're, we're going to place it. Fuel grapes, don't care. 
A animals can eat popcorn? <laughs> Honestly, there might be something there for that. <laughs> Fridge, beautiful. There's our butter. Um, and now we just need an oven. And I, I think we're in the clear. Just re-roll around a little bit. If we get more corn, I'm gonna tell you, I may go all in on that. Two times production and water cost. There's the oven, okay. Um, oven goes right here. Theoretically, should start making chocolate cakes if I have everything right. Correct, I got butter, I still need the wheat. I still need the wheat, okay. That's fine. Those are gonna go here. And that should flow into there. Just make sure everything else chocolate comes in. Yeah, it's just wheat that's that's required. The eggs come in from, from the big old chickens. Yeah, it's good. It's very good. I need wheat. The silo could help us create like a frick ton of wheat. Here's the problem. Getting regular wheat is going to be alarmingly hard here. Two more giant cows is good for this too. Um, just to produce even more milk. Cause you, you, you do need to scale that production up like crazy. Um, none of this matters. Bridge, don't care. Easter bunny, don't care. Fermenter, don't care. It's gonna start to get a little expensive, but I need you to just bear with me. We are completely fine. <laughs> we, we have never been more fine. My fear is that I actually have no way to get wheat. Cause we're in the end game, so the wheat just doesn't exist anymore. Which is a problem. I'm also looking at our fuel production. We're at negative 545. <laughs> seems like a, a small issue more corn is also important um how's the church that's sheep another build we could do at some point um the gnomes are plus five production to adjacent islands crops you know what give me the gnomes um that could be valuable right here honestly they could just be valuable right there. I don't even need to get cute with it. Um, blue wheat? Blue wheat works. Blue wheat can be milled. Okay, blue wheat. Very good. Um, another gnome in here. <laughs> it's just making all that go crazy. Which is lovely. It's very good. Um, blue wheat goes on to this island. And then you just need to get a mill. Which it has to, it has to happen. Give me also the watery trees, because we're going to need to combat the water costs. Although, actually, hold on. Those don't even use water. I'd rather put, like, a watery tree on this island to kill that cost. That's actually much better. Although, why are those back to being weird? Just put another watery tree on this island, man. It'll be fine. I need a, I need a mill. Giant cows are still good. And this is just gonna have a mill on this island. Oh, every tree turns into a cocoa tree. You dummy. You friggin' imbecile. Okay, yeah, that's fair. Giant cow. Beautiful. The lake we can put here in order to kill the water cost on them. Giant cow. Just need... Just need a mill. Just need one mill. It's a very, very simple thing, a mill. I mean, like, it has to exist. There's no way it doesn't. I've got 11 million, so I'm really not all that concerned right now. But I can't help but notice that you don't have a mill. <laughs> Just one little one would go a long way. A lot of fantastic chocolate factories, but no mills. I feel like this game is basically just a reroll simulator. I'm gonna take these silos to, to crank the production of these things. All chocolate bars are divided equally between all animals on the farm and animals get 20 production per chocolate bar. I'm gonna tell you, no. It might be decent, but no. I'm going to crank the production of these though. 
This is what you consider actually a very, I think it's actually a very smart play, but it's a stupid play. And I, I can appreciate that about it. Blue wheat. We're, we're producing an absolute bot ton of wheat, which is very good. Really just need a mill. I know that it's it's a, a wild concept mills, but it would go a, a really long way to, to have one. I know they're in the game, brother. I saw one earlier, <laughs> but they just they there's too many other things in the game. One mill and we have our, our fancy happy little situation all figured out. This, we're up to two hundred fifty nine thousand a turn, man. I can't afford to take this much. I gotta, I gotta stop for chickens. Put these back in. Can I put the Easter bunny somewhere? <laughs> I mean, I guess I could just put you here. It really doesn't matter though. It doesn't matter at all. Are we done? There, there's the rest of that going. I ain't, I ain't got no damn mill. Cocoa trees are not needed. Water cow? I can't even really think of a good spot to put that water cow. Um, I suppose right in here will be good. Centrifuge, blue wheat, oven. Save my soul, please. Just, just save my soul. I'm spending so much on these. Another gnome, that's fine. Water cow here, giant chicken here. The gnome can slip in here in order to boost the production of those, I guess. Can't help but notice that I, I do not see a singular, singular happy little, uh, happy little mill anywhere here. Juicer? Not important. I refuse to spawn it in this time. You, you can be upset, but I will not spawn it in. Because I know it exists. I'm just not patient. <laughs> I think. Maybe. Or maybe it doesn't exist. Maybe there's something in the code that after a little bit... Just give me more gnomes, man. Plus five production for peanuts. Everything that produces water and now produces energy. I mean, these are technically peanuts, it's just they're now going to produce a lot of chocolate bars. So I suppose that's that's pretty good. Put another gnome in there. Don't got space for, for that. We can put another gnome into here in the future. Don't see no mill, by the way. Fermenter, silo. Wish any of this mattered. W wish any of it mattered, brother. But it just don't. I'm just going to take a million gnomes. I'm just going to boost the production here by like a trillion. Just give me a thousand gnomes. Fermenter? I mean, how hard is it to just give me a mill? <laughs> is this really a thing in this game where, where they lock you out of uh, collecting some stuff after some time? Because that's some crap. <laughs> that is That is such some crap. Big not fan, honestly. Because then it just makes the planning even harder to do. Or we're just freakishly unlucky. It's gotta just be freakishly unlucky, right? I'm just gonna keep on. I have no clue if this is actually working, uh, placing down this many chocolate factories. I'm just gonna take some cheap stuff. We, we have to get the... Um, the cost down here for for re-rolling if we're ever gonna have a chance so just just continue to take giant chickens they can feed in we can put more chocolate factories out here i mean we're, we're producing over a million a day um so i'm not too concerned we're down to seventy-five thousand. i can i can re-roll a little bit just looking for a mill looking for a mill scanning 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 i'm telling you i think it reaches a point where certain things cannot actually come in anymore like both uh regular wheat and uh oh i just cranked all of my 
money. <laughs> Give me a crusher. <laughs> Be very cautious here. Am I actually gonna lose? That's so funny. That's so funny. I'm actually gonna lose. Um, how do we resolve that? You put an Easter bunny right here. It's actually terrifying, um, but it'll be fine. This produces an alarming amount of chocolate, so we will be fine. Um, 20 production to cows, but more water cost. Water surplus into wine. Oh, we also just win. It's, it's really unfortunate, dude, because I wanted to see, I wanted to see the synergy work. I wanted to see it work, but it, they, they, they never gave me a mill. The game's also slowing down as I go quickly here, which uh, is fine. Yeah, just just never got the mill. Uh, it's a Thanksgiving disaster. It's not a Thanksgiving miracle. It's a Thanksgiving disaster. Not not giving me the the, the goods. Ten production to animals. No, that's a terrible idea. Yeah, dude, the mill don't exist. That's fine. I mean, it's a sad day for sure, um, but we accomplished our goal. I mean, we, we made the Easter Bunny pop, <laughs> and I think that that alone is fun. I somehow have negative 18 water, uh, which is interesting. I had four fridges in my inventory. Just just slam like a million Easter Bunnies onto the board. Um, we now have broken everything, so it's completely fine. Uh, here, Sugarcane, happy birthday. Thank God we got four of them on that island. Let's just make this the greater island. Um, grating every chocolate bar that you can find. More giant cows, don't mind if I do. Um, water costs is actually irrelevant, so that's good. Water cows, I mean, here, an oven? I'm, I'm building ovens everywhere that you can see. Because that's just the kind of person that I am. Um, we're actually up to 16,000 or 16 million that's needed for our, our rent. So that's a really interesting, interesting, fun social dilemma. Um, hey, I'm going off on a tangent. There's no reason to continue. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, as always, like on the video, much appreciated. I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good rest of your day. Bye-bye.